All right. Anybody else? We've got our two other guests on, and so if oh, no, we got more now. We got a couple more. If anybody else has any more questions, comments, concerns, victories, we always love some victories. You know, we were sharing that we had a we had quite a fourteen getting ready to close. All right, we've got our guest from San Antonio on. Hello? Hello? Yes, can, can you hear me? Yeah, Mike. Hey, this is Randy out of Midland. How you doing? Good, Randy. How you doing? I'm doing all right, man. Just driving home think, right think, now. Work. Things are starting to okay? heat up a little more. Yeah, we can hear you fine. Can you hear us? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's heating up a little bit. Yeah, I'm headed home right now for my old field job. So, yeah. Traffic. Yeah, well, I, think, I know things Picking are getting up. busy over there. My yeah. brother-in-law is over there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what you were saying. Does he live in Midland, you said? No, he's working out of Pecos. Oh, okay, yeah. Not too far. I mean, like I, you know, like I told you, I used to live in Monaghan, but we moved to Midland last August. Yeah, I, I used to work around Pecos a lot. Sometimes I still go there, not a whole lot. But. Well, yeah, with hey, your I'm job, are you able to get any real estate in? in? I, I'm still working on it, man. <laughs> one of these days I'm going to get one. But I, I've been on every call. I think I missed. I think I missed one call since I started. But but uh, that was by accident. I think. I think it just. I just forgot about it or something. Something was going on. I can't remember. But either way, now I was going to ask you, do you guys just, I mean, I know most of your business is in San Antonio, but do you do stuff uh, all across the nation or or what? How do you, what do you and Mitch do? No, we don't, we don't do very much across the country. We, we pretty much stay in Texas for the most part. Okay. I've done okay. a deal or two in Arizona because my brother's there, but besides that, um, we stay in Texas. Okay. But you do. And most do of what we do is with across Texas. Most, we have, um, we've done deals all over Texas, but mostly what we do now is we just kind of realize there's so many deals in our backyard. Let's just keep it in our backyard if we can, you know, unless something yeah. just too good is, is there. So we, uh, we try not to, uh, extend ourselves out too much with how good things are right in our own backyard, you know? Yeah, that makes sense. Now, I was going to ask you, what, if you don't mind sharing, I mean, what's your main, how do you mainly get, find these houses? I mean, I know you guys have, how do you say it? I know you have people working for you, obviously. But, I yeah, mean, we've got, we've got. Direct a, mail a, or what? Um, it's direct mail, cold. We do, we do a lot of cold calling. Uh, we do a lot of direct mail. You know, we do about 4,000 direct mail pieces a week. So, okay. um, a lot of direct mail, uh, and a lot of cold calling. We probably call about 2,000 people a week. Yeah. Two, two to 3,000 people a week. So the people that respond to your direct mail, and then you have your VAs or whoever cold call them? Yes. Yeah, exactly. Our acquisitions guys will cold call. We've had our VAs cold call in the past. That works. Um, yeah. But there, there's a ton of different. Uh, and then Mitch and I have been in this game so long that we get a ton. You know, a lot of people call him and they call myself. You know, a good friend of my dad's called me up the other day and just said, hey, my, my father-in-law passed away. Would you go look at the house and just tell me what you'll give? I walked over there and we made a deal right then and there. And you know, that was just through my dad. Everybody's just heard we've done it for so long. So the longer you're in it, the easier it gets, let me tell you. Yeah, yeah, I know. I believe that. And one, thing I, one, thing I tell, one thing I tell everybody is everybody I ever come across knows what I do for a living. It drives my wife nuts. But I tell yeah. everybody I ever come across what I do for a living because you just never know when they're going to have a problem property. Yeah, like you said, they may know somebody in Delta, though. Yes. All right. Hey, another question on on Livecom. I know Livecom is texting, but is it also if I get with if I get hooked up with Livecom, will I actually?
actually have a phone number where I can actually call people and that phone number will show up. You know what I'm saying? Kind of record it with my regular cell phone or whatever. Kind of like a Google voice number. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't it think like so. I think, it's just, I think it's just for incoming calls. Okay. Okay, but it... But people can call that number or text it, correct? Yes, correct. Okay, cool. All right, man. I guess that's all I got tonight. All right, well, appreciate it. Appreciate you coming it. on. Let's get that first deal under our belts. Yes, sir. I'll let you know about it when I get it. <laughs> all righty. Have a good one. Be safe. All right. Thanks, Mike. See you.